Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Welcome to our last week. Did you finish the platform? Yes, you already passed. Yes. Excellent. Yeah. Okay. Some of your classmates are having troubles because of rain or because of work. So probably we are going to be a few, only a few. Yeah, welcome everybody. Welcome to your first last week in this course. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Nelson. It's good to see you. How was your weekend? It's good. Good. Yes. And the rest? Good also. Okay. You are people that few words, de pocas palabras. Okay, let me check the attendance. Ana Maria? No. Andrea? Present teacher. Excellent. Carlos. Selina Yasmin. Present teacher. Excellent. Claudia. Present. Great. Christian. Present teacher. Excellent. Dalila. Present teacher. Okay. David. David, not here yet. Glenda. Jonathan. Jose Armando. Jose Pedro. Presente, teacher. Excellent. Josué Asael. Nathaniel. Presente, teacher. Okay. Jasmine, Carla Jasmine. No, yes. Carla Xiomara. Present. Ok. Laura. Present teacher. Excellent. Marcela. Present teacher. Ok. Nelson. Present. Excellent. Ovidio. Present. Great. Pamela. No. Raquel. Present teacher. Okay. Saida. Sandra. Sergio. Cindy. Thelma. Present teacher. Okay, great. Thanks. Marcela, you were in the last class. Estuvo en la última clase, no. Yes, right? 
Yes. Okay. Okay, for today, we are going to practice how to tell the time and how to ask the time. Okay, but first we are going to practice some countries. See some countries or places around the world. We are going to practice pronunciation. Let's listen and repeat. Vancouver. Okay, Vancouver. Repeat. Vancouver. 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 Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Mexico City. Mexico City. Mexico City. Mexico City. Lima. 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 Montreal. 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 Yeah. Montreal. Montreal. New York City. New York, New, York City. City. New, York, New York City. New York City. New York City, the Big Apple. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. <laughs> New York City. New San York. Juan. New York City. San Juan. San Juan. Es, San Juan. Um, como un poquito menos menos glotal sería. O sea, no, no tan marcada la J. Nosotros en El Salvador dicen que hablamos con la J, and that's true. Okay, San Juan, como, su, como suave, como. Um, Casi como una O. Ok. Ok. Brasilia. 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 Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo. Paulo. São Paulo. São Paulo. São Paulo. São Paulo. Yes. London. 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 Yes. Casablanca. 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 Cape Town. Kick down. Kick down. Uh -huh. Kick down. Kick down. Kick down. Kick down. Kick down. Cape Town. 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 Cape Town.
Warsaw. Moscow. 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 Cape Town. Cape Town. Warsaw. Cape Town. <laughs> Cape Town. Warsaw. Cape Town. Warsaw. Warsaw. ¿Y la otra cuál era? La que le seguía. Pizza. Pizza. Pa. Moscú. 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 Yes. Riyadh. Yeah. Riyadh. 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 We are Seoul. 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 Bangkok. 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 With K. Bangkok. Tokyo. 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 Sydney. 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 Okay. Now we are going to practice the conversation. Okay. Listen and repeat. Hello. Hi, Debbie. This is John. Muy bien. The girls will be Debbie and the boys will be John. Okay. Start the girl. Girls. Hello. De nuevo, por favor. Hello. <laughs> ya se le olvidó. Okay. Vaya. Sí, se vaya. Está bien porque no les había dicho. My pay attention, listen. Today, listening skills. Porque siempre se los pongo para leer. Now, listen. Pay attention. Hello. Hi, Debbie. This is John. Girls. Hello. 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 Hi. Hi, Debbie. This is this is Joe. This is Joe. This is John. This, this is, is John. John. This is John. I'm calling from Australia. Hi, calling. Mm -hmm. I calling from Australia. <laughs> Con convicción. Hi, <laughs> 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 la demás. Only Nathaniel. And sometimes Nelson and the rest. Los demás boys. Ovidio, José, Pedro, Christian. I'm calling from Australia. I'm calling from Australia. I'm calling from Australia. Okay, Nelson. Los demás, Ovidio. I'm calling from Australia. Okay. Pedro. Australia? I'm at a conference in Sydney, remember? Australia. 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 Oh, right. What time is it there? Hey, make it. I'll put the part of the boys again. Oh, right. What? Wait. Australia. Australia. I'm at a conference in Sydney. Remember? Okay. American. American. Sydney. Sydney. 
a country they system. Remember. <laughs> remember. <laughs> okay, try again. Listen. Vaya. Si se, bueno, no, no sé si se han fijado, pero pueden adaptar la velocidad en los videos. Se lo voy a poner un poquito más lento para que escuchen. Hello. Hi, Debbie. This is John. I'm calling from Australia. Australia? I'm at a conference in Sydney, remember? Boys? I'm in a country of Sydney, remember? And the mass? America on the Sydney, remember? Okay, Pedro. I'm I'm on a conference. Estoy en una conferencia. A I'm on a conference. Lo que pasa es que lo dice todo junto. I am a conference. I am a conference. I'm, I am a conference. O sea, es, I am a, I am a conference. I am, a, dice, I am at a conference. Ajá, pero I lo am, dice lo dice todo I unido. Am este, no sé si vieron en el manual que teníamos cuando íbamos a unir ciertas palabras. Por ejemplo, cuando termina en consonante nuestra primera palabra, como I'm consonant, y la siguiente palabra empieza en vowel, entonces se fusionan. I am a, I am a. Y igual pasaría con el at, a. Entonces es Ara, I am a, I am a conference, I am a conference. Entonces, por eso se escucha como una sola palabra. I am a conference in Sydney. Remember? Remember? My last time, pero ahora sí, repeat. Australia. Australia? I'm at a conference in Sydney, remember? I'm a conference. I am a conference. Conference in Sydney. Remember? I am at a conference in Sydney. Remember? Okay, that's better. All oh, right. What time is it there? Girls? All right. What time is it there? Okay. It's 10 p.m. and it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? I know, qué difícil. <laughs> bueno, lo vamos a dividir en dos. And it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles. All oh, right. What time is it there? It's 10 p.m. and it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? It's 10 p.m. It's 10 p.m. It's 10 p.m. And, and Los Angeles. And it's in, it's Los, in Angeles. This Los Angeles. And it's for, it's for, it's for, for Los Angeles. Los Angeles. And it's for. And it's for Los Angeles. Clock. O clock. Uh, clock. O clock. O clock. They're in Los Angeles. They're in Los Angeles. They're in Los Angeles. They're in the, right. they're Los Angeles. It is a clock there in Los Angeles. And it is four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, right. What time is it there? It's 10 p.m. and it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? Okay, last time. It's seven, it's 10 p.m. in this four o'clock in Los Angeles. Right, 
Right. Uh, right. <laughs> Thank you, Nathaniel. Thank you for your mm. participation. You are okay. very considerate, a good student. I cannot Thanks. say the same of the rest of the boys. Okay, next part, girls. Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Yes, four yes, o'clock in, in the morning. Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Okay. 4 a.m.? Oh, I'm really sorry. 4 a.m.? Oh, really? No sé qué. 4 a.m.? I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. That's okay. I'm awake now. It's okay. Fully wait. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. okay. I'm awake now. Excellent. I'm awake now. <laughs> okay. That's better. Muy bien. Ahora veamos how we are going to tell the time. Ahora sí. Muy bien. Tenemos aquí. Um, first, tenemos o'clock. O'clock, it's zero minutes. Okay, en punto, right? That's o'clock, o'clock. Like the, the class starts at eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. Uh -huh. Eight o'clock. Then we have, um, this is it, a it. way to say it. From minute one to minute 29, we can use past. 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 Que sería como eh, pasado. Pasado las. Eso sería en español. El past. Entonces, siempre cuando vamos a decir la hora, iniciamos con it. it's. It's five past. O sea, pasan cinco minutos de las. It's past five. Y luego decimos la hora. Entonces empezamos, la decimos, en este caso sería al revés. Decimos primero los minutos y después decimos la hora. It's past five. It's five past. It's past. No, it's five past two. Por ejemplo, de acuerdo a, a este ejemplo que tenemos acá. Igual sería para 10, okay, it's uh, 10 past 2. Luego, cuando llegamos a las 15, se utiliza quarter. 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 Porque quarter. si recuerda. Eh, no viene de, de Cora, ¿verdad? Sino que viene de cómo se divide el, un de cuarto. Ajá. Entonces sería una porción. That's a quarter. Okay. Este a quarter aplicaría para cualquier cuarto, ¿no? O sea, pues hablando de fracciones, right? A little bit of math. Okay. Eh, that's a quarter. Entonces, por eso, igual, de lo de, if you have a dollar, the dollar has four quarters. Okay, and uh, if you get in, in a microbus, you have to pay one quarter. Entonces, it's the same meaning. A quarter of dollar, a quarter of 
hour. Sería en este caso. Okay, so that's the meaning of quarter or a quarter. It's quarter past two or it's a quarter past two. Then we have it's 20 past two, it's 25 past, but also you can say it in the regular way. Like it's two, in this case, it's 205. It's 205. Okay, decimos primero la hora y después los minutos, la forma regular. It's 205. It's 210. It's 2. En, en este caso, sí, eh, sería 215. 215. Si lo decimos de la manera tradicional. It's 220. It's 225. Ok. Se puede en ambas formas. Luego, del minuto 30 until the minute 59, we are going to use to. Sería para. Son 10 para las 10 eh, para las 9, por ejemplo. Ok, entonces. And, ah, esta sería la fracción que continúa. We have half. Entonces, acá teníamos quarter, but two quarters make a half. Una mitad. Okay, a half. So, we, we can say it's half past two. It's half past two. But also we can say it in the regular way. It's 2.30, 2.30. Entonces digamos que esta es como la manera más sofisticada de decirlo. What, eh, si le preguntan, what time is it? Oh, it's half past two. Oh, where did you learn English? Right? Oh, puede decir the regular way. Okay. Then we have it's 25 to. It's 25 to. Solo que recuerden que cuando ya vamos de este lado, ya vamos a decir el siguiente número al que vamos, o sea, el siguiente, la siguiente hora a la que vamos a llegar. Cuando estábamos en la primera mitad, decíamos en el que estábamos, ¿ok? Si se fijan, todos todo son, siempre la hora es las dos, pero en la primera mitad decimos eh, it's uh, 20 past two, pero ya de las dos y media para, bueno, de las 2.35 hacia adelante, y ya nos vamos al siguiente número, aunque estemos todavía en las 2.35, es porque vamos a llegar a las 3. Okay, it's 25 to 3. It's 20 to 3. It's quarter to 3. It's 10 to 3. It's 5 to 3. And the regular way, it's 2.40. It's 2.45. It's 2.50. It's 2.55. Ok, y terminamos siempre con el o'clock. Ok, questions? No. No? Are you sure? Muy bien, les voy a mandar este link por si quieren darle una leidita o una repasadita. Ah, Hay algunos videos que están ahí incluidos también para que puedan verlos when you have time. Y okay, luego dice que we use at eh, plus time also 
when giving the time for a specific event. Como el ejemplo que decíamos, the, the class starts at 8 o'clock. Y si vamos a hablar de un evento en específico, the concert starts at 10 p.m. Uh, the flight leaves at 10 to 3. Okay. Entonces ahí especificamos con at. A tal hora. At. Luego dice que para contestar o para preguntar por la hora usamos it, it is. is. O it en is. su forma de pregunta que sería it la is. forma inversa. Uh -huh. What is. time is it? What time is it? Si es pregunta, si es respuesta, it is or it is. it's. Okay, it is or it's. It is. Then uh, here we have the examples. What time is it? It's half past four. Oh, what's the time? It's 20 to 5. Y ahí It's tenemos. 20 to tenemos esos ejemplos de cómo preguntar. But also, quiero ver. Ok, aquí tengo otras formas que podemos utilizar para preguntar. Ok, to ask for the time, you can say, what time do you have? What time do you, excuse me, what time do you have? Eh, luego podemos preguntar por actividades o eventos en específico. What time does your English, your English class start? Okay. What time does you get up in the morning? What time does you go out your, your house? Okay. What time does you finish to work? Luego tenemos, what time is it? Esta es la más común. What time is it? Luego tenemos, do you know the time? Do you know the time? Or do you know what time is it? Okay, solo agregamos el do you know. Okay, do you know what time is it? What time do you, y luego do something. What time do you get a shower? What time do you uh, wake up every day what time do you eat your lunch what time do you go to sleep ok vamos a hacer la A y tenemos la última when when is the movie start ok when is the class finish when is the concert begin ok muy bien, para practicar lo que vamos a hacer lo vamos a hacer de la siguiente manera you are going to pick one of these ways for asking time and you are going to pick someone entonces va a seleccionar una, obviously I'm going to pick the first because I'm the teacher, so I have the power. So I'm going to, to, to pick the first student who is going to make a question. You are going to choose one of these questions. And you are going, you, you can ask um, about what, what you want. 
Puede preguntar lo que usted quiera, pero va a utilizar uno de estos formatos. ¿Ok? Pre preguntar actividades, sobre clases, a, eh, a qué hora hace ciertas cosas, rutinas, etcétera, etcétera. ¿Ok? It's clear. Yes, teacher. No, teacher. Can you repeat, teacher? Do you repeat, please? Mm -hmm. Okay. Bueno, vamos a preguntar. Vamos a utilizar esto. Vamos a preguntar la, la hora o a qué hora hacemos ciertas actividades. Ok. Puede ser... Eh, cualquiera de los ejemplos que le di o pueden ser otros que a usted se le ocurra y tenga curiosidad de saber. <risa> eh, y yo solamente voy a escoger a la primera persona que va a hacer la pregunta. You are going to pick one victim. Usted va a escoger a quién se lo va a preguntar. ¿Ok? Thanks, teacher. Okay. Los demás, it's clear, I think. Muy bien, iniciamos entonces with Andrea. Pick a, a question and a classmate. Andrea? Okay, type it, type it on the chat. Type your question on the chat. And to whom? To whom will be your question? Are you typing? Bueno, lo que Andrea escribe, next victim. Ah, no, no se vale la primera. Es que tengo mala conexión, entonces no sé por qué me saca y me entra de la clase. ¿Cuál era? Do you know the time? Do you know the time? Ok. ¿Para quién sería? Uh, Jasmine de Odanis. Ok. Thank you, Andrea. Ok, Jasmine. Do you know the time? Just mean it, you supposed to respond. Ok, a quien le pregunte, obviamente tiene que responder utilizando las formas que acabamos de aprender. It's la, 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 la. Hey, are you there? Okay, Jasmine. So, Nelson, answer, please. Answer Andrea's question. Do you know the time, Nelson? Yes? Uh... What time you working? No, la respuesta sería. Do you know the time? ¿Cuál know? sería la respuesta? Es. It's. It's the time. Va a decir la hora. Estas preguntas solo es como una, son diferentes formas de preguntar lo mismo. Diferentes ah. formas de preguntar por la hora. ¿Y el detalle a, a tu era club? ¿Qué hora es ahorita? But in English. Ah. Hey, hey. It's. Hey, hey. Uh -huh. It's. Uh, a hey, a club. Eight o'clock. Are you sure? Yes. 
No, it's, it's not eight o'clock. Yes, it's, Raquel. Uh, it's forty. It's forty past uh, eight. Uh, el, el past lo íbamos a usar hasta el minuto 29. ¿Cuál íbamos a usar del minuto 30 en adelante? Oh, Six two. Two. Ajá, entonces, again. It's 20 to nine. It's 20 to nine. Correct. It's 20 to nine. Yes. It's 20 to nine. It's 20 to nine. Okay. Uh, Nathaniel, next question and pick a victim. Okay. Ah, uh, I don't know if I'm going to be a victim. para para Telma. Mm -hmm. Eh, bueno, es que, what, the, what time do you go to work? Ok, Selma. Yes, repeat, please. Eh, what time do you go to work? Work. 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 Ajá, uh work. -huh. Work. Oh. What time? Do you work to go to work? Is five. It's en five. este caso tendría que ser más específica, como le está haciendo una pregunta mm -hmm. específica. La respuesta también tiene que ser específica, no puede ser así, solo, eh, solo general. Um, I'm go to work at. Okay, Telma, repeat. I am go to work at. at at Five. para decir horas específicas at, at. Ajá. y luego dice la hora uh, at 5 at 5 p.m. a.m. 5 o'clock o p.m. at 5 p.m. so you work at night trabaja de noche Yes. Okay. I so, maybe algunos días. Some sometimes. 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 Okay. Okay. Thank you, Telma. Now next. Next question. And Sandra. Pick a question and a victim. <laughs> hmm. ¿A quién, Sandra? ¿A quién le va a preguntar? <laughs> Sandra. Mm. A Cristian. ¿A quién? Raquel. A Raquel. Ok. Make the question. La pregunta. What time do you wake up? Ok. Mm -hmm. I am, I take a shower at, at 10. 
repeat the, repeat the question. Repeat the question. What time? What time do you? Uh, sorry. What time do you wake up? I'm mm -hmm. wake up. I'm wake up at nine a.m. Okay. Excellent. A ver, one more. Thelma. Thelma. Thelma acaba de pasar. No, este, Dalila, sorry. Dalila. La pregunta sería, when is the movie? Para, ay, no, 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 no. para José Azael. Azael, no. Are you there? Good, good. Teacher, eh, voy. Eh, eh, camino a casa ahorita voy entrando ahorita que salí tarde del trabajo eh, okay. no sé eh, a qué se refiere la pregunta o solo escuché el nombre porque está algo cortado la señal when is the movie when is the movie hablando de time estamos hablando de time Ok, um, ayúdeme. Para que le ayude Ovidio. Ayúdele a su compañero Ovidio. ¿Cuál fue la, la pregunta? What is the movie? When is the movie? Uh -huh. When is the movie? The movie at... The tengo. movie is... The movie is at uh, 10 o'clock. In the morning or in, in the afternoon? Uh, at night. It's at 10 o'clock a.m. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's at 10 o'clock uh, a.m. Or in the morning. Pueden usar cualquiera de las dos formas. A.m. or in the morning. Ok, thank you, Ovidio. Vaya, you have to practice more. Tienen que, que, que practicar un poquito más. Y todos se me han ido casi que a lo seguro de los clock. Así que como veo que no se quieren arriesgar, los vamos a arriesgar a la fuerza. Hay que tirarlos así como tiran a los pajaritos de los, de los nidos. Vaya, let's do this exercise. Teacher, I difficult. <laughs> no, it's not difficult. It's easy. Okay, now I'm going to pick the victim. Okay, Laura, number one. It is three o'clock. Laura, what time is it? Uh, 8.49, it's 8.49. Did you listen? Did you listen? It is 3 o'clock. It is 3 o'clock. Okay. Did for the first number one or two? First one or the second? ¿Cuál de los dos relojes sería? The second. The second. The second. The second. Okay. Number two, Claudia. It is a quarter past twelve. Okay, Claudia, what time is it? A quarter past twelve. Okay. The first or the second? The first. Okay. 
Number three. Carla. It is six o'clock. What time is it, Carla? It. Carla. <laughs> well, Carla, usted, teacher. Usted. It, it is six o'clock. It yes. is six o'clock. The first or the second? It, second. Okay. Tú, sí, va, sí. Yes. Ah. Next, Selena, number four. It is half past twelve. What time is it? Repeat, please, teacher. It is half past twelve. Selena? Um, first? The first. And what is the time? Mm. What time is it? ¿Qué hora es? Dígame la, la hora. 12 to 6. Mm, are you sure? No, no, no. Try again. It's 12. It's 12. It's 12 half. 12. 12. Half. Half. 12. 12. 30. Okay, 12.30, yes. ¿Qué otra forma? Half. Half. Pero half, what? Está incompleta la respuesta. After 12. After. Are you sure? Yes. No. ¿Cuál fue la que acabamos de aprender? Past. Ajá. Past. Ahora otra vez, past. completa y correctamente. It's, it's half past six. Past six. No. Third half. Up. A close. No, o clock es para en punto. La hora, ya, ya definimos la hora, está aquí, las doce y media. Ahora, ya me lo dijeron, 12.30, ahora de la otra forma. De half, de half. To one. To one. No. Six. No, six, no. Twelve. Twelve, twelve Sí, es así, ya dijimos que sí, pero usando it, half. It's half, thirty to twelve. No. It's twelve it's past half, half past to one. No. It's carry. Pass yes. to 12. The pass is half, the half, half pass 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 one. 11. Okay. Y nadie escuchó el audio. Ahí estaba la respuesta. Repeat. It is half past 12. It is half past 12. No, there is half past 12. Yes, it's half past 12. En este caso, cuando son en, la, en, en, en el 30, cuando estamos cabal en el medio, ahí sí todavía aplicaría el, el mismo número. It's half past 12. Solamente en este caso de la mitad. 
ya después del minuto 31 para allá, ahí sí, ya no, porque en este caso el hals tiene como su, su propia forma de decirlo, como entonces digamos que aquí no, no es necesario ajá, decir tú, el tú, porque va como de acá para allá. Ok, number five. Um, espero no nos cueste tanto. José Pedro. It is a quarter past nine. Did you listen, Pedro? No. Uh, Telma. It is a quarter past nine. Puedo volver a repetir, teacher. It is a quarter past nine. It is a quarter. It is a quarter past nine? Yes, it is a quarter past nine. Yes. Solo que con acento británico. Okay, number the first one or the second? Thelma. Three. The first one or the second? And the first. The first, okay. Two. Yes. Number six, Asael. It is a quarter to three. Repongalo de nuevo, Tisha. Play it again, please. It is a quarter to three. It is a quarter of the three. Again, repeat, please. It is a quarter. It is a quarter of the three. It is, it is a, a quarter. A quarter. Mm -hmm. uh, it is a quarter. It is a quarter for three. Four. ¿Cuál era la palabra que, te, que íbamos a utilizar? No, it no, is a no, quarter to three. Ah, no estaba. It is a no. quarter to three. Si sí, se queda en español, sería como un cuarto para las tres, ¿verdad? Pero uh -huh. no sé cuál es la palabra. It's a quarter to three. Uh, it's a quarter to three. Yes. Sería fir the first or the second? Uh, the first. Okay. Number seven, yeah, the last one. Ovidio. It is a quarter past six. Repeat, please. It is a quarter past six. It is the quarter past six. It is a quarter past six. First or second? Ovidio? First. Uh, El... Primero y segundo, second. The second, yes. And the last one will be for... Nathaniel, what are you? For Nathaniel. No te veo, well, pero ahí está. Hello. Okay. okay. Number eight, Nathaniel. It is half past nine. Okay. Uh, uh, otra vez, perdón. Again, please. Again. Again, please. It is half past nine. Ay, no. No entiendo. Es que no oigo bien. 
Better. Again. Again. It is half past nine. It is. It is half past nine. Yes. <laughs> okay. It is, it is half past nine. It, it is half Pero past nine. Seguridad. Okay. It's half past nine. The and first the, or the second? First. Past nine is the 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 first. The first. Okay. Y, 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 y quería decir algo. Si el si el the six es un cuarto para las tres no sería the second. El number six. Ajá. Si es un cuarto para las tres. It is a quarter to three. Me it is a quarter ahí. to three. Yes. Ah, pero es que no hemos checado. Okay. Pues yo pensé que iban a salir como en rojo o algo. Ahí dice check my answer, no, no le tiene que dar ahí. Con... Ahí, check my answer. Y yo señalando en la comp. <risas> yes, eso sería. Okay. ¿A quién le jalamos las orejas? ¿Quién me dijo la number six? A ver, los demás. They are correct. Yes, it's a quarter to three. To three. Two para. Three. Para las tres. It's a quarter to three. Excellent, Nathaniel. Ya ve? Thanks. Okay, right. questions? Preguntas? De... Asking the time. No, teacher. No, teacher. Ya nos queremos ir a dormir. I am hungry. I think. Hungry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. okay. So, let me check. Where here? Ana Maria. Carlos. David, Antonio. David, Antonio, no. Eh, Glenda. Jonathan. José Armando. José Azael. Carla Yasmin. Present teacher. Ok. Pamela, Saida, Sandra, okay. Sergio, mm, Cindy, no, Sergio, Cindy, no, okay, so that's all for today. Thank you for your presence. Don't miss the last classes. We only have three more classes together. So see you tomorrow. Okay. Bon appetit. Okay, see you tomorrow. Bye bye. bye. See you tomorrow. Hello. Bye bye, teacher. Bye bye, teacher. Bye bye. Good night, teacher. Get rest. Bye. Bye bye.